My name is Joseph Gordon, and I'm dancing the first movement in George Balanchine's Symphony in C. Symphony in C was originally titled Palais de Cristal. He re-choreographed the work for New York City Ballet at the City Center stage in 1948. I think at this moment in the piece, I'm really thinking about presenting who I am to the audience, because up until this point, I've been with my partner. This is really my moment to show who I am. I do like to turn, so I find these pirouettes to be really fun, especially when you have a good day. <laughs> the music keeps building and building and building. It's really exciting when you hit it. It's always great when you get that validation from the audience. It helps you to keep going. <laughs> Here's a moment that can feel really heavy in the variation. I try and think about having an easy breezy upper body, shaping my feet, and just writing the music. All of Balanchine's choreographic ideas are laid out in the music, so those of us who have been trained at SAB, we're really just presenting all the ideas that we have been given as students. This is always when you do not want to go to your knee. I've danced a lot of different roles in Symphony in C. My first was the demi-soloist in the first movement, then I moved to the principal of the third movement, and the most recent has been the principal in the first movement. They're all very difficult and all in different ways, and I think that's something that always I come back to whenever we have to start rehearsing Symphony in C or perform Symphony in C. It just never gets easier, it never lets up. It's so exposing in that way. This is a moment where I just try and think about focusing on one step at a time to make sure that my ballerina feels as comfortable as possible because these turns can get a bit dicey as you're both starting to feel what Symphony in C is made of. I love this step, I think it's so beautiful. Something about the way she comes around your body and then flips to the front just is so organic and nice to watch. try and make these pirouettes with her musical, and then just enjoy the ride home. The ballet is very much rooted in classical technique. It is a vehicle to showcase Balanchine's ideas about classical ballet. It basically encompasses everything that we seek out in the Balanchine aesthetic.